but this is a great time of year for having a fireplace, a nice, warm, cozy fireplace. Sure. Throw on a little Harry Connick Jr. You're all right now. <laughs> to do is actually take my firewood and use it as decor. So I've got these these great bundles of, of, of wood right here. You just throw them by the fireplace that adds to that storage out and, and visible. So it makes I love it that. really nice. Yeah, it makes it very good. cozy. Now tell me about, uh, the, the, where's the stump furniture? Okay, it's yeah, over what is here. that? It looks like a, okay. like a stump. Now I just became a parent, so I think a lot of you us did? parents, yes. When? I have a 10 month old baby. Oh man. <laughs> Tell me about the baby. He's amazing. He just started walking. He's saying no, which is probably his only word forever. What's his name? Preston Cruz. Oh, that's beautiful. He's a wonderful little gem of mine. I love him to death. But you know, we've been reading books lately, and one of my favorite books to read to him is The Giving Tree, right? Sure. You understand Absolutely. that book where you've given everything you got to your kids. Well, I love the very Looks end of like it. Looks like somebody gave you a treat. <laughs> At the very end of it, when there's just a stump left, I've decided to create a piece of furniture out of that idea. So let me show you how to make one. Sure. Now that stump over there can actually be bought at any store for about $500, but we're gonna show you how to make one for under 100 bucks, you guys. Do you like it? Yeah. I love Isn't that. Isn't it amazing? Yeah, it's great. Do you like it too? Very much. What's great in, about the, this Giving Tree stump is that it actually is a one-of-a-kind piece, so each, give, each stump is gonna be unique to its own. Well, a dumb question, but where do you go stump shopping? Oh, that's not a dumb question. <laughs> You can find these at any floral mart. You can find them at your local, like when they're selling bundles of wood for oh. the fireplace now, you'll find these. Hey, sometimes you might even run, fall off the back of an old truck. Right, sure. You know, if you find it on the side of the road. So if you find it at a floral mart, they'll actually plane it for you, making sure that the tops and bottoms are nice and smooth. Mm -hmm. What you'll want to do is take a crowbar, hack off the old bark around the outside of the, of the stump. Okay. And then this is called a sanding block. Sanding block. Yeah, you can find this at any hardware store. It's great, it's kind of a sponge. And you'll just kind of sand it down so that all of the edges are nice and smooth. Right. And then you'll want to give it a nice polyurethane. Do you know what that is? Yes, I do know that you okay. paint that on like a sealer. Yeah, exactly, okay. it's a sealer. Okay. Then you'll find yourself some furniture legs and you can find these at any big box store, any hardware store. You can make them mid-century modern like the ones we've got or really nouveau riche by adding some stainless steel ones on there to make it really modern. Sure. Um, but all you gotta do is screw on the base. Have you ever screwed uh, Leave it right there. Um... <laughs> Use a screwdriver. Yes, of course, I've used a okay, screwdriver. Okay. Haven't you ever seen Hope Floats? I was a carpenter. Oh, that's right. <laughs> yes, you am dreaming. There you go. Oh, you did a great job. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. It's and always been my dream. And then you, and then you put this right in. Screw, screw yep, that right just in. like that. You got it. Yes. Okay. This is very, very cool. Do y'all cool? like this? Do you love it? I think this is cool. You can do this at home. Laura Mack, you're yes. great. Let's Thank you so much for being here.